hello guys today we are going to predict some value using machine learning so we have two data sets one is the test data set which we need to predict as you can see the blank spaces there and one is the trained data set which has already been predicted manually as you can see there is yes and no already entered so what we have to do next we have to open Beka tool which is a machine learning tool having different algorithms in it so we can apply into the data set and get our required value so we need to explore open file go to your file location select your test data set.csv file which we need to predict and then remove the features which we don't want to have in our prediction let's remove all those things unwanted things and save it into the ARFF file format which will be further used while prediction now we need to open the train data set which is in CSV file format and remove the same parameters which you have removed earlier and then go to classify okay so this is what the prediction you have done with respect to the features so you can understand it very well and then go to classify use training set choose that algorithm whatever you want j40s is decision free which is very good and start and you can see the result is came at the predicted the prediction is 99.23 percent correct so it's very good prediction regarding accordingly and now we need to supply test set data set what we have saved earlier in dot arf file format we need to supply that then the class should be the same as the earlier one select that and start it again and then got it use visualize classification error and save it as a result now we'll have a look what we get as you can see we have got the predicted result here so this is how prediction has been done using Vika tool and now you can change this ARF file into a rows and column so you can further upload it into the database for further development of the application so just follow these steps to convert it into a CSV file and upload it into the database it's just comma because the ARF file is separated by commas here we go we got a table look here just remove the unwanted things here and there you go we got the table look here which we can upload into our database so you can clean the data set here if you don't want anything else from there and you can upload it further so if you need any further explanation comment down below i'll try to provide and upload a video as quick as possible thank you guys